Hello everybody, welcome back to SSDOJ. Today we're jumping in here again with the Sandy Shores Police Department. Um, this time we're going to be jumping in here with the 2010 Dodge Charger. Um, this is part of the LSPD fleet, but I went ahead and made it undercover. And we're going to keep it black for now. Um, actually, no, I'm going to switch it up to like a grayish. Really quick, and we'll be good to go. That. There we go, the dark steel. Turn my hazards off. Let's go ahead and jump into this and see what we can get into. Still need a long got traffic stop 277 North Panorama Drive on a two door white and purple vehicle, unknown occupancy. Looks like I have two Lincoln one on. They have blue stops. I got them. Yeah, he blew that stop sign. When I rolled past them, uh, I don't know. He, he stopped on the side of the road, so I was going to see what's up, and then he just took off, and so I followed him a little bit, see what was going on, and then he blew that stop sign, so. Not sure he's wearing a seatbelt either. Let's see that. Also, getting for window tap. Yep. Alright, sir. Officer Lana with the Los Santos Police Department, TEU. You're just being stopped today for blowing a stop sign and it looks like you're not wearing your seatbelt, so it's gonna be a seatbelt violation. And for the window tent. Yeah, I'm definitely wearing my seatbelt, my man. Well, doesn't know your passenger wasn't, so why if you weren't wearing your seatbelt? So I'm definitely that wearing mine, so you. you're definitely not gonna I'm be charging me mine, today. Okay, mm. well one of you wasn't wearing your seatbelt. Do that with my dashboard right there, it's not uh it's not blinking or nothing. I yeah, because you anything. just put your seatbelts back on. No, so, definitely license didn't. Registration, proof license, registration, proof insurance. Passenger, what's your name? I don't need to give you that info. Oops, the right thing. Listen here, sweets, after we're done this traffic stop, I'm gonna have to get you out and you're gonna polish my rims, alright? <laughs> I'll do anything for a dollar. I'm definitely not paying you. You're just gonna do it. Where are you guys heading to? Ah, just out for a drive. Nice. You like, like the ride? Car. Yeah, I do. Thank you, thank you. Tooling goal at two, Mary 11 at Tooling goal. Go ahead. You want to question why they have uh, a plate on that doesn't come back in the system? That worked. Quick question for you guys. More specifically, the driver. What's up? So, why is your license plate not coming back in the system? Uh. Uh, it should be. One second. The DMV is closed right now, so I'm, if it was an error and their system's not going to be able to fix it till tomorrow. 
Uh, is there a vehicle to register me? The vehicle is not, the plate itself is not coming back in our system, so the vehicle is not registered at this time. So is there any reason for that? Sorry, it takes some a while to think. He's a yeah, slow burner. it you can should. Appreciate that. It should be. It should be in there. I'm not sure what's what's going on with that. Okay, because my officer back here just ran it and advised me that's not coming back. So I'm not sure what to tell you. No, looks like you'll be getting a uh, plate ticket today. More or less a, a play ticket, maybe like a fix it, like so I can go to the DMV and get well, that situated. It's what? not going to be classified as a plate ticket. It'll be more of a registration, which is not a fix it ticket. It's a citation. So does that mean like I'm like you're going to take the vehicle from me? Let me look in the penal code real quick. Pardon? Let me look in our penal code real quick. I mean, I don't know. It's my vehicle. Like I, I own it. Okay, well, it's, doesn't matter, so. Okay, so it's a five hundred dollar fine, and it's a tow, but it's officer discretion, so this officer back here wants to tow the vehicle he's more than happy to. He can do it if he wants to. It's up to him if he wants to. Um, but it is an automatic $500 fine. And whether or not uh, you guys I'll take the 500 to, but like... Whether or not you guys get to be able to drive this away is up to the officer back there, so. Alright. Hey boys, can I get out and have a cigarette? Um, you can smoke a cigarette inside the car. Hell no, you ain't smoking a cigarette in this ride! Okay, well then it looks like you're out of luck there, passenger. Such if you a want, boner killer. If you wanna hop that... Okay. Can I get a reword? Uh, uh, yeah, I understand. <laughs> He's calling me a boner killer? No, 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 no. He called me a boner killer. I just said this... I just said the situation was a boner killer. Well... Killed my boner. No. Okay. okay, okay. So, our issue here right now is that you have a plate on your car that isn't registered. If it's not yeah. registered, there's no way you should have that plate. So that means there's a fake plate on this car, so... Settle well, down, buddy. Alright, relax. So, I own the vehicle. I'm gonna show you the ownership. It must be an issue with you and the DMV. I, can show, I showed you the registration. Why would I have a registration? It's obviously legit. Uh, okay, it's an issue on your end. Like, back. I don't know what else to tell you. The DMV failed me. Like, okay, one sec, sit tight. Okay, let's go and change the subject now. Let's not bring up the boner killer again. Why are we talking about boners? The passenger brought it up. He said the situation is a boner killer. <laughs> Which it was. Why, why, is he, why is he a boner? I don't know, why don't he you come it. and uh, be the boner enforcement and ask him. Okay, I'm um, coming over there. No, that's Get not your job. No. Go. Sir, you're that's weird. You're, that's too why? personal. That's weird. That's too personal. You're weird, oh, well, man. You told, you told me to, you're my chief. You know. I did not tell you to. You to I was giving Settle a suggestion, down. but Get that your is officer your under control. I'll speak to him later. He, he should be able to decipher what his job and what it isn't. Well, He's an adult, isn't yeah, he? Yeah, he should. But, you know, that's why I'm gonna speak to him later. Alright, fair enough. I'm dealing with this right now, so... So, did you like, passenger's back broke or something, or...? Cause, like, you're why? Just, What's up? You're just, like, chillaxing in the driver's seat and lean back, and he's, like, all hunched up. I don't know. He says Long he's got a story. Working hard. Day he says his work. back hurts. We'll just leave it at that. Yeah, his like, his, I don't even know.
I don't know, yeah, he's a weirdo. I see his foot on right, the outside of the door, which is kind of scary. Yeah, well, that's weird. They be getting a site, two citations a day. One's gonna be for the window tent first offense, which is a $200 citation. Then you're gonna be getting an offense for failure to stop at a stop sign, which is a $250 citation. Also, it's gonna be two points on your license. So you wanna sign there on the bottom, not a mission of guilt. What's his name? It says you'll just take care of it, or you wanna take care of it in court. Court dates are on the right hand side. Listen, man, officer, you'd probably be a little uh, more I'm chill so if you got some pants to fit you. Those are looking a little crotch grabber to me. Oh, my God. Somebody needs a citation. I'm... You're lucky he didn't give you the $500 citation and tell this. I know, I know. So you better just I'm, I'm be just grateful teasing. I'm just got. teasing. I'm just teasing. I'm just teasing. It was all in good faith. We're just teasing. All right, how about I tease around and tow your vehicle? Okay, buddy, yeah. relax. Okay, how about... Hey, coach. Okay. Put, guys, pump put your seat on. Fix brakes. the window. Fix the window tin. Stop at a stop sign, and get out of here. All right. I don't want to pull you over again. All right. Listen, you're gonna be peeling the window tin. <laughs> He's just having the passenger do everything. It's great. Oh my God! Did he put a seatbelt on? I don't know if he put a seatbelt. Nah, probably not. Not that I care. I mean, I do care, but. I'm gonna learn and try to stop cool for that. But I just pulled over for it, so it's not the big deal. And if he does not go to the speed limit, bro, I'm gonna be so mad. Really? I just sit there and rev the engine. Okay. Sure. Sure thing. Oh, okay, I'm just gonna go straight. I was gonna go back by the station, but sure. Let's go this way. That guy literally wants to go everywhere else that I'm planning to go. Which is just mighty terrific. Bum -bur -bum -bur -bum -bur -bum. Dealing with one, I got a traffic stop, 297 East Island Avenue, driving a two-door purple white vehicle, I cried times one, I got one at 32, if they can advise. Five up before it could be part of a gentleman. Thank God. I got pulled over again. My lord. They're ridiculous, bro. I can't wait to see what they get stopped for this time. <laughs> Probably the same thing, to be honest. If you almost hit him, you almost got into a traffic accident. He oh. was kind of in the rear, rear, rear left window, so I can't roll it down. They don't roll down. Listen, I'm trying to get to the auto body shop so I can get it taken off. All right, I want to see you with dark windows anymore. No, I'm going there right now. Roll them down so you can see. I, I told you, I can't roll the back windows down. Well, roll your driver window down. There, there you go. Now get out of here. Oh, by the way, um, okay. What? No, no, um, no, I'm just, uh, he... Same vehicle, We're closing. Are you going for a stop sign? Give me purple and white. Uh, two spark for attention. My registration entrance. Give me a stop for a stop sign that you guys obviously didn't learn from last time. Where's your passenger? I dropped him off! Wow. Oh. See if I just can go to my times one now. Alright, so take. Some people just don't learn. Obviously. <laughs> I think, yeah, maybe it's, they're still glitching, so I don't know. I'll run the stuff myself and see. It'd be one. Could not be one. 
Well, depends. On if I got fixed match with. Yeah, no, it's an average. He is getting a registration date at this time. Well, I don't know. Because he's been pulled over three times. And there's nothing he can do until the morning, anyway, so. Okay. Sure. So the window tab. Nope. Nope. He could do. He can deal with that. In the middle of the night. Two Mary Lemon, show me 10 to 7 disembarking from MBU. Um. Because, I mean, some place. Like, he could peel it off no, the top one. No, I mean, I guess he could wait till the morning if you want to get like a professional place. But. take him to jail. I don't care. He's been pulled over 55 times. You ought to know. Bro? Bro? Quit moving! I don't know what he thinks this is, but he backs up again. He's getting out. Good yield. Oh, I probably went over it like 15 times. Yeah. 8 6, 250 bucks. I don't see where. Um. The uh, get on the bike. What are you doing? I don't see where he put in the uh, information. Where he got those citations? All right, we're gonna be getting a two hundred fifty dollars citation day for the stop sign. Hopefully, after the second one, you'll learn. I'm going to the bomb submission guilt, so you're gonna take care of court. You gotta come to a complete stop. There stop you go. Yeah, copy. I know. The wrong information back to video address safe. Tell the function on the cover today. I'm not sick and tired of dealing with this guy nonstop. Bro. It's enough. Is he just sitting there? In the car? Or is he like inside? He must be inside. I don't hear him now. Okay, there he is. I do. How's it going? Huh. Hi, Frank Yoger. I just got shot and everything, yeah. so I'm not putting up. A yeah, line. I saw you. I saw you on the thing. On the. Uh... Alright, everybody, turn around. 
for me to wrap up this episode of SGRP. Hope you guys all enjoyed, and I will see you all next video.